compared to one that's in the lead coming in. That is uh, Butch Cropfeld and the Lipship. Uh, Otterbach, very successful. Won the Nationals three times with that bit of That's a lot about it. Yep, that's a lot about it. And uh, let's see, his, oops, here's more footage, different heat. A lot of times on a weekend, there, you might see him out on the water four times. You know, elimination heats uh, both days in a separate race, both days. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's, uh, that's Jimmy Sellers on the right and uh, Butch Cropfield in the middle. And that looks like Anne Duchel that just came up on the outside there. The Y18? Uh, Y16. Oh, okay. And that was one of those uh, Smith Halls that uh, came out of Cincinnati. Oh, Don Struck? Yep. Right. Paul Bauer built a couple more off the Smith design himself. He built one, in fact, at a, at a boat show in Cincinnati during the show. Built a hydroplane. Here's the guy who ran the Nanette boats, wasn't he? Uh, his were Cat and Man. Oh, Cat and Man, yeah. Yeah. Okay. There's Butch running good. This Different class, this is like S boats. See, who that is here on Lake Decatur. Okay, this is the one where it's Yellow Dog, right there in the middle of the yellow boat. Uh, Joe Schulte. Okay, looks like nine yeah. boats coming out of this. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, heavy, heavy class. It was a stock class. It was, uh, it's just like the E-Class. The E-Class at one time was the biggest of all, and the S-Class was uh, right behind them, okay. uh, total entries. Probably because they're both stock classes. Right. And people wanting to get into the sport, uh, you don't want to go with the highly expensive ones. Right, and they had to be competitive classes too, because they all were kind of running the same amount of power, basically, right? Yeah, the stock ones were, yeah. yeah. That's a static or conventional. Red calling? Yeah, it was the Flying Tiger at one time. I'm not sure whether that's the name that's still on it. It had a real exotic BMW engine in it. Kind of bouncing around there a little when he went into that turn. Yeah. And here comes a lot of that looks like the Earl Hall. On the inside or the outside? On oh, yeah, the the box. The one on the inside uh, did look like a ladder box on it. Uh, that looks like Madam Blue, that's a Carolson. Yep, that one there. Yet under another name won the Nationals, that Madam Blue. Okay. That's Butch Cropfeld again, this is in the, uh, a coal cat. Well, he was driving more on a boat, one boat that day then. Huh? Oh yeah. A lot of times Butch would drive three, Jim would drive two or three. Wow. At big, at big events especially because uh, uh, like one of Jim's owners was from uh, Louisiana so he wasn't at every race that Jim was at. Hey, there's a uh, Blue Carlson, yep. and what? Madam Blue, and then uh, Butch Cropfield and the Cole Cat, and there's Philly Lip Shoots, and the Come On, Come On was the name of the boat. Uh -huh. And 
that looks like Jimmy Deal. New Martinsville that uh, made that great run? Um, same guy. I'm trying to think of the same boat. Yeah, the boat looks about, the same, about the same time period, yes. Yeah. The main difference was the cowlings that told which year it was made and stuff okay. like that. Hmm. There's that study here again, the hot stuff. I think he had three different Stoddakers. Hot stuff does. Wow. Okay. So this is seven liters. That's long gone. And I think it's Idlewise on the inside. Larry. Larry Lauterbach. Okay, long gone for sure. Oh, 
shit, there goes the, uh, that's Terry Turner driving that one. The letterbox special. Yeah, different, 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 uh, bunch of those. Canadian girl. Oh, the boat out in front is a Milosevic, Kevin Bale, the Advance United. Mm -hmm. Did I just see Miss Wendy out there? Yeah. Yeah, Miss Wendy's there. these guys than the unlimited because that looks like a real race going on out there. They're all fighting. <laughs> yeah, they're having to drive pretty hard. There were a lot of boats that were, uh, I would say, in the final heat type category. Yeah. Good running boats uh, right at this time period and then on again for a number of years in the GP class. 